quick demonstration here of this uh, lovely Harrison M250 we fitted an inverter onto it on, uh, different speed controls got a 1.1 kilowatt inverter on plenty big enough to run the uh, 0.9 kilowatt motor so we've got we've got a reset circuit that energizes the power onto the machine we've got a low level kick stop which knocks that off as an emergency stop we've got it also on this uh, gear cover guard that knocks it off as an emergency stop we can run uh, jog we can jog the machine I'll demonstrate this later in low speed but we can put it into run so now we're at around the 1500 rpm range and what the inverter allows us to do is we can turn this down to a thousand rpm or even lower we can, we can go down to 750 so we, we actually bridge all these gaps between the 750 and 1500 range or we can actually go up to 2000 all the feeds work lovely machine nice and smooth nice and quiet we can also run it in reverse So I'll demonstrate the jog function for you now. So I'm going to change the speed. Going to change the speed to A2, which is 40 RPM. So we're set there now, 40 RPM. So when you're doing screw cut and you need to just inspect your work, you can just press the jog button, it just inches round, nice and slow. Superb action, superb. Get it back into B. B3 is the 750 range. So what we can do on the 750 range, running at 750 RPM now, what we can do is we can turn that up now, up to a thousand rpm so we're bridging these gaps between 750 and 1500 oh we can actually turn it right down but we may as well just be using the other the other speed settings all together lovely machine Up, reverse the feed direction so now we're feeding in we've got the uh, we've got the chuck guard connected to the uh, input signal on the inverter so when you open the guard it stops the lead you can do your checking whatever you need to do all your measuring and then you can just restart the machine just by closing the guard all together lovely little machine behind this screw cover here we've got uh, these lead screw engagement for screw cutting so when you want to do screw cutting you just slide that over 
that drives the lead screw, it'll screw cut. A massive range of uh, metric threads. Also on order, due to be delivered maybe today or Monday, is a full set of change gears to cut imperial threads on this lathe. Absolutely stunning condition. This lathe has hardly done any work. It's in fantastic condition. And you can tell that because you can hear it run. No strange noises associated with it whatsoever. Fantastic little machine. So I'll just demonstrate this kick bar for you. So if you're running it, and something just goes totally wrong for you, just kick the kick bar and it stops instantly. Kills all the power to the machine. Fantastic machine. I really can't fault it in any way. It's got uh, three tool holders. It's got the external jaws. It's got the cam lock key. It's got two chuck keys. It's got the six inch brand new four jaw chuck. It's got the spindle adapter to MT3. It's also got a, a three jaw chuck with both internal and external jaws. Superb machine with the Harrison M250 machine, manual included. Can't go wrong. Get it bought.